Yo, what is going on, you search and destroy savages? It's your boy Tupac, and I am back again today. Finally! I know that's what you're all thinking. Bad top goddamn time, what happened to these daily uploads? And yes, you're right, I'm a scumbag. Now, while I'm talking about being a scumbag, I thought it would be the best throw on the scumbaggiest gameplay I have. This is Elkar Akimbo with the Gorgon, with Rejack. I don't think you can find a filthier setup in this game. Yes, I'm not only a scumbag for not uploading, I am being the biggest scumbag. Now, I know what you're all thinking, why the hell haven't you been uploading? You got nothing better to do, you're level 900, and this is going to be absolutely mind-blowing to some of you guys, but I have had some stuff in the real life, the IRL stuff pop up. Like, I know what you're all thinking, you're goddamn level 900, you can't have a life, this must be everything, you must be a chubby in your mother's basement, but that is false. I'll, I'll let you guys in on a thing or two, let you know a little bit about me, I've just hit 200 subs, so why the hell not? Now, let's start from the beginning of this story, like a long, long time ago in a land far, far away, I went to school. Like, um, I dropped out of year 10 or pretty much got kicked out, but that's a whole nother story for a whole nother video if I get around to it. But, um, pretty much, I've dropped out of school, I went to TAFE to study to be a bricklayer, it's like some TAFE course, I ended up completing that TAFE course, this is about five years ago, four or five years ago, and I ended up getting a job towards the end of the TAFE course in bricklaying. So I did a bricklaying apprenticeship for four years, which I've recently finished. Now, what I've been thinking as career terms, like, obviously I'm not working at the moment. You wouldn't be working if you're level 900. Like, I'm probably the highest prestige in Oz. Like, no, I haven't seen of any legit hire, but there might be out there. Maybe there's one on Xbox, who knows. But anyway, so pretty much, I've dropped out of school, I've got myself a bricklaying apprenticeship, and now I've come to the end of my bricklaying apprenticeship, and I've had a change of mind, and like, a different career path I want to go down. Now, it's going to be a bit of trouble, like, getting into the career path, but that's what I'm going through right now, and I'll let you guys in on it. So there's no guarantees at this point that I'm going to be in the army, but it, it's looking good in my favour at the moment. I've completed part one of a two-part pretty much process of getting myself into the army. There's more involved than that, but it's pretty much like I've recently applied and got accepted to go to a U, UE interview. Like I booked to go to a UE interview, I was old enough, I meet all the base requirements. And basically the UE, it's a bit of bit more like information, you do a test there, you see a medical lady, and like the test is a comprehension test to see how smart you are, and see what roles you're available to apply for in the army. Like if you do really bad in it, or if you're colour blind at the medical, or something like that, you're not going to be able to apply for much in the army. But I ended up doing pretty well according to the career counsellor, who, who was at the in UE interview, so I'm pretty much able to apply for any role I want in the army, which is pretty good. Now, the only problem with that is, and the reason I haven't been playing much lately, is because I'm having to go back and do Year 10, because obviously I didn't complete it, so that's like one of the minimum requirements for like most of the stuff in the army is Year 10 completion. So I'm just doing a few short courses at TAFE, which I've had to book and like start studying for, so to get the second part of the army, which is the interview, the formal interview, it's pretty much like a job interview, like I go there and tell them why I want to be in the army, I've got to research the roles I want to go into, and I haven't really decided decided what roles I want to do yet, but that will come towards the end of when I'm fully studied and able to apply for the job interview. Like at the moment, oh, it's a good time for me to like actually apply for the army because I've recently announced like wanting to get like a few more thousand people in the army, like 9,000 more jobs that are available this year, which hasn't been the case for a few years. So it's looking pretty good in my favour, like everything's working out and if I can get this study done, go ace this job interview, then there's a high chance I'll get into the army. So that's just a little bit about me and kind of an explanation as to why I've been nerding this game out more than I have been. Because I've completed my apprenticeship, I'm not doing as much as I used to, like I'm not working full time, I've just been grinding COD and nerding it out. And in the meantime making some video for you guys. Anyway, it's getting to the end of the gameplay, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, remember to smack that like button and if you're not subscribed, hit that one too. It does help the channel grow. Thanks guys.